Hey guys, it's John from the Reaper blog. This week I had a couple questions about how do I get my toolbars to be in specific locations in the window. And I realized that I hadn't talked about that before. There's not really a trick to it. I think it's just the knowledge. There are multiple docking locations that you can put any window in Reaper. By default, your mixer is probably docked on the bottom. How do we go from this to something like this with an extra toolbar on the side of the mixer and with the effects browser here. And if we add the Media Explorer, we've got that here. How do we get that? So let's start with the Media Explorer. If we click and drag this, we can change the locations. If we click on the tab, we can actually change the locations. And uh, let's move it up to the top where it's really obvious. Have a look at that gray line as I move around the window, that's the location that you're going to dock. So we want this on the lower right. That's actually, that's not quite right. We want this here. Nope, we want this. We want this here. There we go. That's the only tricky part, uh, getting stuff to to align correctly. So with the toolbars, you can see here there's no tab visible. So um, what you want to do is uh, have this window floating. You then choose position toolbar in toolbar docker. So you grab the tab, you drag it over to the location where you want it to go. We don't want it to the entire left side of the window. We want it just uh, on the side of the mixer. Uh, that's not right. <laughs> there we go. Bottom left. Not on the side, but on the bottom. There's one other thing. Um, I'm going to click in the empty area of the toolbar, the main toolbar. Open uh, this one called editing. And then I'm going to show you some other positions. So there's at the top, or at the main toolbar, which just put all those buttons down below going to position this at the top of the main window and uh, floating, I've already seen. With floating, you can put it anywhere you want on the screen. In toolbar docker, but sit down at the bottom or closed. So uh, top of main window, I like quite a bit. And the transport can also be moved. So transport position, put it above the ruler if you prefer. If we have a MIDI editor open, this can be docked, can be floating, um, can be floating, and inside the MIDI editor, there is also um, additional eight MIDI toolbars that you can add to the piano roll if you desire. So that's it for toolbars and docks in Reaper. Hope you learned something. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Check out reaperblog.net for tons more. Subscribe to the channel to keep up to date with all these tutorials. And I'll see you guys in the next video.